Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to create a scratchy effect on your videos, like an old grained movie with some scratches uh, using iMovie. So first thing we go into our hard drive uh, within iMovie 09, click on a plus sign and let's create the uh, project name, give this one scratchy, scratches just like that. Uh, we're going to be working with the white screen. We don't want any of these themes, so create. Now that we've got it done here, uh, let's import our movie. So right click on whatever uh, on whatever date you have then in the event library. And we're going to import movies which are already on the hard drive. We go to our desktop, castle, create new event. Uh, castle okay full original size copy files import okay now that we have it simply drag the entire video put it in the project library sound here which we don't want so let's cl click on this arrow first go to the audio adjustments and take the volume completely down click on done and now you can see we can't hear anything which is great now if we click on this arrow again we're going to clip adjustments click on a video effect and choose the aged film effect now we can also slow down the movie so it's gonna give this nice nice effect as well let's give it about 50 percent uh stabilization if you want to use smooth clip motion as well i won't be using it for the purpose of this video uh okay that's all fine let's click on done now if we try a movie you can see it looks like an old 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 movie from whatever time now let's export uh, the movie using uh, QuickTime and we're going to save it to the desktop as well name scratch is fine uh, settings if you click on the QuickTime options uh, we will be using H264 uh, compression time uh, we can increase the quality as it's short video so it's not going to affect it really that much uh, that's all fine actually size uh, current because it's uh, it's been actually yes uh, 960 by 540 that's fine sound is fine fast uh, prepare for internet streaming as well okay save it may take a few while because I have to apply all these effects in the video okay now that our video is done if we go to our desktop open the scratchy you can see we've done quite a decent job now okay uh, if we go back to the to the iMovie that is obviously if you have version 9 of uh, iWorks installed on your iMac uh, on your Mac now, if you haven't got it, uh, there's another uh, uh, way of doing this. So if we uh, go to the video adjustments, uh, sorry, clip adjustments, and we take this effect off, uh, we can leave a speed. Yeah, we can leave a speed, which is fine. Click on done. But now if you want to do scratches uh, and you haven't got iMovie 09 installed on your uh, machine, you can also do it using uh, just a QuickTime quick export. So if we go to export using QuickTime, go to options, click on the filter under the video section. And if we go to the special effects, uh, under special effects, you've got film noise. You can see it's, it's, it's applying actually these effects straight away. Uh, now we can check, uh, change it to sepia tone, for instance. It's not as good as the one built in uh, iMovie 
09 but you still can get some some kind of effect which you may which you want which you may to want to achieve actually so obviously you've got you've got all these parameters here you can play with uh, dust size as well uh, dust density and so on so it's entirely up to you how you want to go with that then you can change the colors and so on so uh, that's another way obviously then you just export exactly the same way we, as we've done with the previous video and everything's everything's done so that's that's everything in this video uh, I'll speak to you later